Hello everybody. Uh, today I'm doing recording and playback test for both decks. I'm recently completed upgrades. Uh, both decks are in almost new shape and like plays records very well. Heads almost new. Condition was in my clades. I was the first serviceman I, for the top deck and the second one for the lower deck um, because I b bought it, uh, serviced it from Japan but uh, I had to redo everything myself to make sure that it's records and plays really well. What I also did, uh, for the lower deck I replaced capacitors with audio grid capacitors and replace it, uh, stack it, or like sequentially connected capacitors, bipolar, with one bipolar, twice less capacity. And now that one is the best deck I ever had. They all like close, like close to a Kai, Pioneer, KS7, but uh, sound patterns is really, really nice. And you would be able to hear it yourself. So just not forget, I start recording my digital recorder was the songs we will be playing. Uh, top deck. It's a 965 to well deck and it was I was the first one who serviced it. It's a immaculate shape, really nice done deck. But the sound was flat, no bass, like not interesting. So on I was playing with upgrades. I replaced capacitors with audio grade. It helped a little bit but not to the level I'd love to. Then I was playing with uh, uh, replacing op amps and I come up to keeping the original one. And then I started playing out with the different capacitors values. And finally I've got combination when I proud to present you today. Now it sounds plays like almost the same as uh, major high-end decks. The only difference is in resolution. You would be able to hear yourself that bass is there and this plays really nice. Uh, connections, tape one, top deck, tape two, lower deck. As usual, this is a tape. This position is a digital source. So you would be able to hear yourself all the differences. Now, let's start from calibration process. On top deck, it's quite quick and easy. It does everything automatically for us. It adjusts by three parameters, um, by level, bias, and equalization. And the lower deck, we will do calibration ourselves. Give me a second. So you see right well, done, quick and easy, and left well. And while it's doing, I can even start calibrating the lower deck because they are connected independently. My C levels are too high, a little bit on the bias. Done. I all three decks ready for recording. Lower deck is three head deck, so I would be able to switch tape source. Uh, but we still would have to wait for the upper deck to complete recording of the song, and then we will be playing back and comparing. I, I will do recording on both tapes here and here. I believe I have already set up levels, so I'm just clicking pause and all decks should start recording at the same time. Okay, now enjoy the sound. I hope you will like my choice.
Okay, now we will be playing it back, so we can switch back to auto mode. I'm rotating to the beginning, and we would be able to listen and compare the sound between the two recordings. You already heard a 555 recording during playback. It's immaculate and it's so open and so good, Swedishina, and so close to original. At the same time, so now like warm and nice. And I'm just excited how it sounds. I would highly recommend you to use headphones or good speakers when you will be listening to it because this song has lots of low frequencies and to be able to hear everything your tv or phone would not be sufficient all right now i will start playback on the one well on the top deck and it will automatically trigger playback on the 555 esl or esa deck and uh, you i will be switching between different decks and you will compare the recording sound and then I just reveal uh, roll and play back from the other well on the top deck. So enjoy. Currently, top deck is playing.
Okay, and now I will turn this deck off just to because it reacts on the right well as well. Uh, now we will listen to the right well. I will fast forward to not play all the song again, but to give you test that both wells records exactly the same way. Okay, as you may hear, sonic patterns like frequency response, balance, like openness, bass, all there. So I believe I was able to achieve a pretty good results. Now I will remove these Sony tapes and install two other Sony tapes into this deck, type one tapes. Uh, and we will do quite interesting scene. So first of all, I will run calibration for each tape to make sure that uh, it will record at the best performance. Now it reads. And calibrated. Now write well. Uh, I believe you would need to record with a little bit lower level because it's not a metal tape. I will use automatic levels anyway. Uh, I will record on the left well with Dolby C and on the right well with Dolby S. I, and then we will compare how these two systems sound. So I'm resetting counters. I'm starting A plus B rec. Uh, click and pause on the right well to start recording on both wells and starting the song. Enjoy.
Okay, and now I will rewind left deck fully to the beginning and right I will stop it around like two and a half minutes. So we would be listening for the left deck on this Dolby C recording and then I will stop it and switch to the right deck with Dolby S recording and we would be able to compare. Enjoy!
Okay, this would be probably it for today. Uh, I'm interested in your opinion. I was sitting and listening and on my mind, uh, Dolby S1 sound was more natural and more open than with Dolby C. Uh, this deck now like is uh, performs as a top level. Like I'm not sure you would be able to find the, any other two well deck which would be even close to this guy. Um, let me know your thoughts. I believe both decks are perfect. They play better even like than Nakamichi and like Akai 9100 I have. Uh, I mean ESA deck. Uh, it's really a true high-end and like uh, it's more live compared to 9100. Even if they are very, very close. I was comparing just this morning and like it's really enjoyable sound for both of them. So thanks you for time, thanks for your attention. Leave your comments, what you like, what you dislike in my videos. Because I'm getting less and less time to do this work due to my primary assignments. So let me know what do you think. It was good. To see you on my channel today hope you will come more for my videos bye bye